Okay, we're supposed to simplify improper fractions in this video. I don't know why they're called improper fractions. I actually like them just the way they are, but some people don't like them this way, so we're going to simplify them. So let's simplify 6 over 5. The way I do that is just take 6 divided by 5 gives us 1, doesn't it? And how much would be left over? So 6 divided by 5, this is what I'm doing. I'm doing 6 divided by 5 gives us 1 with 1 left over, doesn't it? 1 what? 1 fifth left over, right? We'd have 1 fifth left over. So 1 and 1 fifth. Let's see if that works on the next one. So let's do a similar problem, and that one is this one, which is 9 sevenths, 9 over 7. So 9 over 7 means 9 divided by 7. If we had 9 divided by 7, well, we could get 1 7 out of that. If we took 9 divided by 7, we could get 1. We'd have 2 left over, wouldn't we? We'd have 2 sevenths left over. What did I just do? I did 9 divided by 7. I got 1. 1 times 7 is 7. 9 minus 7 is 2. So this 2 is this one, and this 7 is this one. Do you see that? Let me show you what I'm talking about. Show you what I'm talking about here. This seven right here, or well, that seven right there. That's the one. You know what I'm saying there. Uh, and um, uh, this two that we got from this two right here is this two right here. So that's where I got that. So let's try just one more and see if we can make some sense out of this. This one's a little bit trickier. It's ninety-two tenths. We have ninety-two tenths. Well, so I'm going to just do this really quick math over here. Do 92 divided by 10, and we know 90 divided by 10 is 9, so 9 is 90. 92 minus 90 is 2, right? And we divided by 11, if you remember. No, we didn't. We divided by 10, didn't we? So we'd get, do some coloring, 9 and 2. Tenths. That's where all that stuff came from. And we can check and see if it worked. 10 times 9 is 90. 90 plus 2 is 92 tenths. Oh, oh, look at this. 2 tenths. 2 tenths is the same as what? Do you know? 2 tenths is the same as a one, a fifth. How do I know that? Because 2 goes into itself once and 2 goes into 10 five times exactly. Doesn't it? Okay, you guys. I hope that was helpful. Seriously. If you, hey, if you haven't already subscribed, please subscribe in your comments and uh, and questions are welcome, okay? Thanks.